Hello there, watchy people. How is it going? Welcome along to the Rags to Riches series on Farming Sim 22. Um, blimey, we're, we're getting close now. Only three episodes left after this one. And then, uh, then we'll be all on the new game. So that's cool. Hey guys, this is uh, Editing Rob here. Just uh, to acknowledge, well, <laughs> acknowledge the fact that I didn't acknowledge that this is episode 100. I didn't realise till I got here in the edit. This is episode 100 and I did nothing special. Um, so yeah, here you go. This is your opportunity to go yay, woo, and enjoy. Here you go. Here's some like fireworks or something. I don't know. Uh, <laughs> enjoy having a couple of seconds of festivities of episode 100. Uh, yeah, let's get back to the farming. I'm just dropping this off. Uh, you saw me mix this up at the end of the last episode. So let's throw this in. We might as well use it all, put as much as we can in. I won't put you through uh, doing another mix, I don't think, today. I think you've seen enough of that already. Uh, so we'll just drive this back to the yard and then see what there is to be done today. I feel bad about this bit being driving through the crop still. Like, I feel like I want to put the road in, but I don't want to sacrifice the crops that I've already planted, you know? Um, and once I've harvested, there's not really going to be a lot of point because <laughs> the series is going to be done then. <laughs> so, yeah, there's not really a lot of point in putting it in. Maybe, maybe I should. I don't know. Maybe I should do it anyway. Maybe I should do it now and actually sacrifice the, the crops. Because they would die if I was driving over them anyway. It's only because I'm playing in cheaty mode that uh, they don't. Have to go on left there. I'll drop this off back over here again. Uh, and then, yeah, we'll see what happens. It might be that we just keep um, keep moving forwards. Uh, how are we on field? So animals should all be fine. Sheep have got food. We checked those. Ducks, oh, they're down low. Oh, my word. Okay. They've got enough for one more month. Um, so let's let's hope that something's uh, <laughs> ready. And there might even be stuff ready now. But, yeah, the cows are now fine. Um, their water is... is they got loads. They're, we're not going to have to do that, I don't think. What's their health? Their health is now at 10%, so it is creeping up. Since, uh, I mean, it's only during today that that's gone up, so. Yeah, that's that's good. Uh, we've got a little bit of milk, but not a lot. Let's look at the fields. Let's see uh, if anything is ready to harvest. No, nothing's ready to harvest. So they're, at the very least, there's one more month until the food for the uh, ducks is ready. I think we may have done too much of that. But then I didn't know how soon the series was ending, so I was sort of hedging my bets a bit. Let's have a look at time-saving stop check. There is nothing worth selling in June, according to that. Um, the only things that are good price are stuff that we don't need rid of. Can we actually sell that anywhere? Location, pallet storage. Okay, I, oh, that's, that's where it is. Okay. Oh, sell everything. You can sell it and sell everything. So I could sell this herbicide because we don't use that. I mean, that's worth four grand at the moment. Uh, when is the best price for that? Max month is March. So we're already past that. So I might as well sell the herbicide, to be honest. Because um, we're not going to use it. So let's hop out of this. Uh, and then I assume it's only going to go down in price. Uh, in fact, let's just dump that straight in here, because we might as well. We haven't got any straw for another mix anyway, so it's not like uh, we can really do anything with it. Uh, where is our herbicide? Let's go find it. It's going to be one of those two uh, over there, isn't it? Oh, it's the top one. That's handy. Question is, is my uh, is my forklift work good enough to pick that up? Uh, I'm going to vote no. Oh, and I would be wrong. How about that? We managed it. Oh, that's all. 
herbicide. Both pallets. Hmm. I wonder, have we even got a sprayer at the moment? I don't think we do, you know. Can I carry both in one go? That seems like a, a lot to ask to me. I don't think that's going to work, but we might as well give it a try because whilst we're not a fram, we are fram adjacent. Like, if, I, if this was in Patient's Farm, then that that's more of a fram, to be fair. Right, let's do that, and hopefully that should stay on, I think. That looks decent. Right, I was going to um, pause the journey so that you guys didn't have to watch, but uh, <laughs> I think the potential for shenanigans is super high. So if I'm careful, we might be alright. I just wouldn't want you to miss it falling off. <laughs> so let's uh, let's just record the drive over. I don't think I've got anything to tell you guys about. I've, record I've recorded this. I haven't looked at your comments for last week. I've recorded this one straight after that one. So, because uh, it's my, well, last weekend now. The weekend of the previous video was uh, my mum's uh, 70th birthday party. So we've travelled down uh, to be there. So, and I'm staying for quite a while. I'm staying Friday till Wednesday, so I won't. There'll be quite a lot of uh, missed opportunity for making videos, so I'm, I'm making sure to do everything ahead of time. Um, right, let's sell this. Does it actually work? Will it sell it? Because I, I don't know how. Is this actually sell everything? Uh, I don't even know if it is or not sell everything. Yeah, it is here. It's supposed to sell here. Do I have to take it off the forks first? That didn't do anything. Maybe I have to... Um, do the wood one? No. Okay, so I don't know how to sell that. Uh, 1,045 litres. Yeah, I don't know. How do you sell herbicide? Anyone? Let me know in the comments if you know. Okay, I am back. And uh, I don't think we've got anything to do, you know. Everything's fertilised. Uh, it's all good at the moment. So, yeah. I haven't missed uh, a honey selling thing, have I? How are we? No, we're only... Only, uh, what, two-thirds full there, so not even that, just over half. Um, so no, I've not missed a... I would be... I would have way more honey than that if I'd missed a selling session. So we're good there. So I think what we should do then is just fast-forward time and do the dailies tomorrow. So let's speed this up again. 5,000, head into July and pray and pray and pray, actually... Before we go too far, let's uh, move this, come on, there we go, into here, because it might as well be working on it. Um, right, oh, I always press 9 instead of 8 for speeding up time, it's a bit of a habit that one, okay. Good old property income again. Right, let's go back down to three. And we've got another one. Look at that. Look at that. You can't argue with that, can you? That's uh that's amazing. So let's um let's do the rounds again. We got a tractor near the thing? We don't. Okay, let's use this one again then. Uh, although it does have the weight on. I think this one's fine with the weight and the trailer. I don't know otherwise, so let's uh, grab this. Yeah, this this is okay. I don't know if anything is harvestable. It looks like it is, look. It's all golden brown and yellow. So this could be the start of the harvest uh, today. I'm excited about that. That means we're definitely going to get a, uh, a hyperlapse 
Oh look, everything's everything's come ready. We're gonna be so busy today. Uh, might even need to turn the time down to. Oh, that's up. Let's put it down to one because it could be a, a long day today. There's actually a lot more silage here than it looked like there was. Um, how are the ducks? I suppose it doesn't matter actually because I can't give them anything until I've done the harvest. So there's no point in checking. Um, let's chuck this down. I don't know. Let's just put it on the grass here for now and I can always move it again next time. Um, but we do have lots more wool. I came at that totally the wrong angle. There we go. Thankfully I was near enough to everything. No lettuce. I wonder if we're out of water now. We do have, however, a full pallet of eggs, which is good. You love to see it. Let's jump out. I do this every every time now, so I don't know if you guys are bored of seeing it, but I mean, you've not got much left, to be fair. We're, uh, we're nearly into the new one. I don't know what to do with the new one. I don't know how to approach it, whether to just start a normal game with like everything that it gives you. Um, so that we get to see a lot of stuff fairly quickly. Maybe that makes the most sense. Start an established farm that they give you and then continue it uh, until such times as there's enough mods to be a, a good um, start from nothing series. Because it would take a while. I suppose it wouldn't take too long doing contracts. And actually, contracts is probably another good way of seeing all the stuff. So. Maybe we won't do it that way. Maybe we will just do a rags to riches again. Because, um, yeah, why not? Why the heck not? Then, we, yeah, we can just keep doing contracts to see all the different jobs and do use all the different equipment. Uh, what did I do with the eggs last time? Oh, they're over by the uh, lettuce, aren't they? Yeah, so that's cool. So I'll just leave that there for now. I think there's still quite a lot of eggs in the Mayo facility anyway, so it's not, uh, I don't think it's going to be short. Right, in which case, I guess it's time to get a harvest in. So what shall we harvest? Let's have a look at the map and just see what's ready. Uh, more or less everything. The sunflowers are not ready. So we've got canola and we've got barley. I guess barley is the um, the critical one because um, we need to feed the ducks. They are they are gagging for food. So let's um, stop this here and uh, take our harvester out for the first time. This is exciting, guys. <clears throat> got this massive harvester this is going to take no time at all I've, I've got a really wide header as well I will kind of regret getting the wide header because everything's going to be over so fast but I suppose with what have we got three did I say three episodes left I don't want to do everything in one episode oh hang on that was the wrong way to do that wasn't it no don't do that put it down again there we are. I need to uh, I need to tow it first. Uh, is that the front or the back? Got the warning triangle on it. Oh, it's got it on both ends. I don't know which is the the front and which is the back. Where is the drawbar even? I can't see a drawbar. I did unfold it again, right? Uh, <laughs> have I done something wrong with this trailer? What? Oh, there it is. There it is. It was just hidden in the grass. I couldn't see it. I still can't see it. 
sort of off at that angle, I think. Let's try again. Wow. What great viewing this is. There it is. Oh, I missed it. There. Nice. Okay, we got it. Let's do this. <laughs> okay, so I'm going to do a... Uh, oops, a hyperlapse. Uh, excuse me, driving through the crop. I do not have crop destruction on. So it's fine. We won't worry about it. I've been a bit lapsed with that. I really should be putting in... Oh, wow, that wasn't good. Really should be putting in the roads, uh, the tracks through the fields properly and and doing it like it was real. Uh, is that through the gate? Yep, it is. So I can go forwards. Right, I'm going to do a hyperlapse from here. I'll do putting on the header as well because, you know, all adds time to the hyperlapse. Um... And yeah, I will... Oh yeah, this this um, song, this AI song, is by uh, Ask Was. Go check out his channel. Um, there's more farming on there. And it is called... The Farmer's Rise. So uh, yeah, sit back and uh, enjoy it. Started in dirt fields, no shoes on his feet. I scrub work the land under sun's cruel heat Dreams were a luxury, crops were his world Pocket full of struggle, jar of mail unfurled Days turned to nights without a soul to talk Whispers in the wind, friends with shadows on the walk Jar was his charm, held hope in its glass. Tides of fortune coming on the blades of grass. Mayonnaise in his hand, hope in his heart. Never did he falter, never did he part. From the dream of a life where riches would flow, I spoke the farmer tale. Everyone should know Stumbled upon gold beneath the garden green Fortune sweet embrace in the place unseen The jar never empty by his side it stayed Paying days and riches in the life he made Built a mansion vast where fields used to be. Riding waves of wealth, he's finally free. But in his lofty halls, memories remain. There are roads and dreams bound in the jar plain. From rags to riches, story carved in time. Ascrobe's journey, a soft rock rhyme. Mayonnaise is a symbol of enduring hope In the vast fields of life we all must go Well, there we are. That's, uh, that's that done. <laughs> so that, um, that harvester is quite the thing to handle. Um, it doesn't like the hills. I, I think the problem is, is that header is way too big for it. Even though it's a massive, uh, massive harvester. Uh, it can't cope with the uh, the size of the header. When as soon as I turn it off, it's like all the power comes back to the machine. But yeah, going uphill, it was like two miles an hour, um, and it yeah, it just was it was not having a good time. Oops, I've uh, gone over a bit there. Oh, R B N Y. There we go. I'm pressing all the wrong buttons today. I don't know what's wrong with me. I'm uh, I'm clearly not thinking straight. But uh, let's get this all topped up. Hopefully. Hopefully they didn't actually run out of food before I put more in, but uh, you never know. This thing's got such a vast uh, capacity, this chicken coop. I don't really uh, know why it's so high, <clears throat> but uh, nevertheless. I, it's interesting like trying to figure out what things are worth doing and what things aren't, because I, I, I've been watching that Bally Spring series by Chainsaw 100, why did you not finish the row? Oh, because you ran out. Okay. 
That's fair. I can see that. Uh, turn the engine off as well. I mean, I feel like it, it ought to have detected that little bit and gone, you know what, I'll just finish that off. But never mind. Um, anyway, let me know what you thought of the uh, the AI song. Don't forget, you can uh, submit your own. Just go to suno.com to generate one and send it to me. I'm sure there are other sites that do it as well. But yeah, you can do that and uh, and send it to me. Let me. If you have trouble getting hold of me, just put a comment to say you've got one and I'll help you sort out how to how to get it to me but um, but yeah they're always a fun time I do enjoy those uh, there we go right get the last of this out of here and then into the uh, the ducks coop um, sorry what was I saying yes um, I was watching uh, the Chainsaw 100 Bally Spring um, series, and um, yeah, somebody obviously put in a comment to him that the amount that he was making out of um, out of the cows, it felt like just making and selling silage would be far more profitable than feeding cows and producing milk and selling the milk. Um, and I'd like to see the numbers on that. I'd like to see if that's actually true because, again, like it may it may be that's true to life. I don't know, but because um, the thing is that people need milk, whether or not there's well, I suppose that would mean if everybody stopped making milk in order to just sell silage instead. But then I suppose you're you're only selling silage to people who are using it for cow feed. So if it, nobody's feeding it to cows, price of silage drops as well. So I, I don't see that it can be like that in the real world. It just it just wouldn't work, I don't think. Um, yeah, the the economy would would balance itself out because um, there's no yeah you wouldn't be able to sell silage. So yeah, it was an interesting question. But in the game anyway, in the game because the game is obviously not not hyper realistic. It's uh, somewhat realistic. It's a close approximation, but with bonuses to make it actually fun to play <laughs> so um yeah i don't know where we are in terms of episode time i'm guessing we're probably what would i do about 15 minutes before the hyperlapse so we're up to nearly 20 i reckon we're about 20 minutes so there's probably another 10 minutes worth of content to make so i don't know what to do right now i can bring the uh harvester back that's one thing oh, there we go uh, yeah, I think this header is probably far, far too big um, for this. And I think it's probably not worth changing now. In fact, I was going to drive it back, but I don't need to because I have to get it into that field. So I am going to have to put it down. Um, there we go. And then I can uh, hopefully... I've not left it in a very good position, have I? Oh look, we've got quite a bit more honey now. That's that's nice to see. Right. Are you going to hook on? Yes, you are. Well done. Uh, hopefully... Oh, that's going to get around that corner now. It does. Oof. <laughs> um, and then we can drop it again. And pick it up again. Is I think we'll do this harvest next time. This is the canola. We've got two fields of canola to do, so we'll probably do this in the next episode rather than this one. There's no harm in uh, setting the machine up ready to go, is there? Um, driving this big thing around that small field made me realise why... Um, why people leave borders. Like I'm like, why surely you make use of every possible square inch of field right um, no <laughs> no that's not a good way to do that <laughs> um, you want to leave a border because you're just going to catch your header on everything uh, it's definitely the right thing to do um, let's leave this in fact I don't need it just yet so I'll drop it here so that we can mow the grass next month because we'll probably do that before we make more feed. 
Um, so, what do I need? I need the baler next, I suppose. That makes sense. Do some straw bales. Uh, and, yeah, let's do another hyperlapse of that. Listen to the end of uh, Wazzy's song. Um, wonderful as it is. And, you know what? I'm going to drive down the road to save driving through that field of... Uh, ready ripe crop again I'm just gonna go down here and start here why not why not add a tiny ounce of realism to a series that I've completely gone away from that on I started off being like 100% I'm gonna do everything realistic and it's gonna be super super like professional and everything and I just like after about 10 minutes I was like yeah this is boring I'm just gonna <laughs> I'm just gonna do what I want to do <laughs> I hope you guys are enjoying it I need to unfold it first uh, I hope you guys are enjoying it anyway, nonetheless. Um, but yeah, I will see you after this. Let me know how many bales you think in the comments. Take a guess, how many bales are we going to make um, out of uh, this this one bit of straw that we've got here? And we'll do another competition next time. Well, not competition, you don't win anything. You win the bragging rights of saying you were right. Um, next time we'll, we'll do the same on that field. Uh, and in fact, all the other fields. Um... <laughs> So yeah, I'll see you shortly. From rags to riches, story carved in time. Asperl's journey. A soft rock rhyme Mayonnaise a symbol of enduring hope In the vast fields of life we all must cope We all must cope That was uh, quite a lot of bales. <laughs> we push it out. Yep, yeah, we can. We got 98%. I don't think there's another 2% in the field anywhere. There's a tiny, tiny bit over there. I don't think that's going to be enough, though. It doesn't matter because we've got a whole other field to do yet. But oh, may maybe there is 2% there. Maybe there is. No, not quite. <laughs> not even 1%. Okay, well, that's fine. Um, so we can now be done with that. Uh, superb. That seems like quite a lot of uh, goings on for one episode. So I think we're probably going to call it there. Let's go check out how the uh, how the ducks are doing now that uh, they've been fed. See if they're at 100% health. Yeah, 100%. So no worries there. We got that all sorted. It's now been... Um, Quite some time since we fed the cows. Well, I say quite some time. Maybe it hasn't. Did we do, did we move a day since we last checked? Um, ah, they're at hundred percent now anyway, so that's cool. And we now have four and a half thousand liters of milk, so that's superb. Um, we will have to see what the deal is when we sell that. Whether it's uh, whether it does actually work out as being more money than um, uh, than just selling silage. <laughs> Because that's an interesting question, if you ask me. Um, I think I think there's, yeah, validity to it. Like it's probably close enough that it's worth doing. Well, not me doing the math. I can't be bothered with that kind of nonsense. But someone doing the math. Um, it'd be nice to know. So Ken's the guy that normally does those things. When I make these comments, he's the one that looks it up. So uh, there you go, Ken. There's your homework for this week. Let us know. Was it? it might have been last week that I mentioned it. I can't even remember. It's the trouble when you record two episodes together. You can't remember what you said. Uh, in which episode but um, yeah there's your homework Ken you need to work out whether it's whether you make more money from selling silage than you do from feeding cows and selling milk I'm sure but I'm absolutely certain by the time you take into account buying the uh, like the feed mixer and tools and things that you need you had to buy a bucket and we already had a pallet fork but you know that sort of stuff um, and the tanker, you need a tanker. I, I guess I already had that as well, so maybe that doesn't count as well. I don't know. But either way, um, actually, that's going to need 
water, isn't it? Oh no, it's still got some. It's good, still got some. Uh, is that actually working? Is that not being used? I feel like maybe that switched off. No, it is going. Strange. Okay then. Wow. <laughs> um, cool. Right, well that's going to do it for today. So yeah, thank you very much for watching. I really hope you enjoyed the episode. I hope you're excited for the end of the series coming very soon. Um, yeah, three episodes time. And uh, yeah, if you're not a subscriber, please do that. That really helps me out massively. And don't forget there's links in the description for Discord and merch and that sort of stuff. You can find my Instagram. Is my Instagram on there? I don't know. It's just, I use the same name everywhere, anyway, ASQ Rob. So you can just look me up on any service. And if I'm on it, you'll find me. Um, so yeah, I'll see you guys in the next one.